I'm Erin Sullivan. I'm a certified sommelier. I'm the general manager of Acme Fine Wines here in the Napa Valley. And I'm a proud member of the Wine Sisterhood. And today we are coming to you from Rutherford in the Napa Valley, where we want to talk about wine glasses. It's a seemingly simple topic, but it's one that we've all been confused about at some point or another, wondering if we're just doing it wrong. So today we're going to talk to a master expert and she's going to explain to us that somewhere between this $1 mason jar and this $100 wine stem, there is one wine glass that might help meet all of our needs. I am so excited to be here today chatting with Andrea Robinson, one of the leading ladies in wine. Andrea is one of only 17 female master sommeliers in the world, also has won the coveted title of best sommelier in America, and together with her husband, John Robinson, has created an amazing web series that you can find on her website, andreawine.com. Daily tastings features daily videos and educational materials. It's just outstanding, so you definitely have to check it out. Additionally, she has created this groundbreaking series of stemware called The One. When it comes to wine, you'll never know everything about wine, yeah. and as long as you don't let the, that be intimidating to you and, and find that it, it's exciting, mm -hmm. it's an okay thing. And that's, that's really why I got into the glassware world, because I felt like for a lot of people, stemware had become as complicated and expensive and intimidating as the wine itself. Right. And to the point that you need a wing on your house to have every correct <laughs> stem for the right wine, I think, you know, most people who really get into wine would rather have a wing on their house for the wine itself. Exactly. <laughs> so simplification without compromise on the performance because mm -hmm. as a sommelier, for me, it's all about the wine and not the actual glass. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I feel like people sometimes can feel like they're doing something wrong if they're using the wrong right. stemware and that just closes off so many people who might otherwise really be enjoying wine. That's they right. They have to follow the rules. Here's another rule that I'm, that I'm going to mess up, yeah. right? And, and so what, uh, you know, inspired me to do that was, first of all, the understanding that some of the confusion around the, the sort of benchmark stems out there was the notion that you needed to control where the wine hits on your tongue. Right. And as a sommelier, um, I, I'm very, very uh, convinced that how you taste a wine has everything to do with your nose. Mm -hmm. And in fact, most of us know if you have a cold and you taste a wine, all you taste is acidity mm -hmm. and sweetness if it's there and you feel the burn of alcohol, but you don't taste all the complexity and detail that's in the glass. Right. So how do you even begin to start designing a wine glass? I mean, did you have background in that or you just started by comparing and testing? You know, I, I as a restaurant sommelier, I had worked with lots of wine stems and so I had my own views of what works and what doesn't, but we really did get pretty scientific about it. And it turns out there are actually two ones instead of one one. <laughs> There's the one for white and the one for red because what we learned is that you do need a bigger bowl for red wines to better aerate them. They just need that to show their true colors. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to the whites, you need a smaller opening and a smaller size to preserve the chill and the delicacy of the aromas. Okay. But in terms of the shapes themselves, which are unusual, mm -hmm. um, my husband and I, uh, he's a great collector of wine, and um, we spent about three years first uh, determining what were the best performing stems and determining what about their design was important to the performance. So okay. the vertical depth of the bowl, the opening of the diameter of the rim and all that stuff. And then we took all of those elements and created prototypes that, that put them all together. Mm -hmm. Interestingly, for both white and red, it was a similar shape. And then we yeah. tested those against our favorite stems, all the benchmark top competing uh, stems out there for about two years with every style, color, quality level, age, appellation, grape of wine wow. that you can imagine. Um, Pretty and, arduous work, I'm sure, opening oh, all those bottles. <laughs> People always say that, right, when it comes to sommeliers. But, <laughs> but uh, no, it was definitely fun and a labor of love, to be sure. And uh, and then we tested them blind with master sommeliers and masters of wine around the country. Awesome. So they didn't um, know what wine was in the glass no. at all. And okay. they didn't actually know what glass they were tasting from because they were truly uh, blindfolded. Oh, wow. Yeah. And that way, uh, we were able to sort of feel like we were getting a true objective uh, tasting. and. We developed so much conviction around their performance of being able to bring out the detail and the fragrance and the uh, and the complexity that a winemaker works so hard to preserve. Sure, yeah. So they're the babies. Oh, it's amazing. Like them. <laughs> yeah, so much hard work. If they're really gorgeous to look at too. Thank you. Beautiful shape. And the other thing that for us was important for me as a mom of three mm -hmm. um, was practicality. 
but you don't have to be a mother of three to really want them to be affordable sure. and to be able to want them to be practical. Well, already they're more practical by just having two. But the other thing was that we worked with a manufacturer in Germany with a very great resistant lead-free crystal. So there's no lead and there's durability. And then it's also dishwasher safe. Oh, mm -hmm. hallelujah. <laughs> so how much are these amazing stems and where can we find them? So they're on andreawine.com, which is my website. They come in packs of four for $49.95, so about $12.50 a stem. And um, I wanted to create a discount code for the sisterhood, so I'll give that to you guys for 10% off. And anybody who orders two or more four packs, so let's say you got one of each color if you needed one of both, uh, there's free shipping, so you don't have to worry about that. Oh, perfect. And we can visit andreawine.com to learn more and about your daily tastings, and thewinesisterhood.com as well to find that promo code. Thank you. Awesome. Cheers. Cheers.